Hello guys. I hope you are all doing well. Today I have a new tutorial for the game Beam and G, which I think will be useful for all of you. There are important points in this video. Be sure to watch until the end. In BeamNG.Drive, on the long desert road map, I ran into an odd issue. Some parts of the map had this annoying, flat orange panel with the words no material written on it. It seemed impossible to ignore, especially when I was filming. A lot of times, I had to change the camera angle just to keep this orange screen, sometimes even purple or pink, out of the shot. It was honestly distracting, and I felt like it took away from the cool scenes I wanted to share. So, I went online to find a solution. I searched the web thoroughly and looked up videos, forums, and support sites for BeamNG. But everywhere I looked, the advice was the same, clear your cache and restart the game. Even when I posted in the official BeamNG forums, there wasn't any other clear solution. No matter where I turned, I couldn't find anything to actually get rid of that ugly screen. But I wasn't ready to give up. I figured, if no one else has found a way to fix this, maybe I could find one myself. So, I started experimenting, and as surprising as it may seem, the solution was much easier than I'd expected. Now, I'm going to show you exactly how to fix this problem. First, open the game and go to the Long Desert Road Map. Remember, do not save the changes made at any stage. I will tell you the reason. Once you're there, press F11 to enter the World Editor Mode. Next, select Terrain Tools from the menu. Now, click on Terrain Painter. 
A new window should pop up with a list of all the materials. Scroll through the list and look for something named warning underscore material. When you find it, click on the trash icon next to it to delete it. Give it a moment, and all those hidden materials will load correctly in the game. And that's it. That annoying orange screen disappears completely from the map. Now, you can enjoy the game without having that distracting screen showing up. It's not time to save yet. I will tell you in a few moments. As you can see, you don't see any orange or purple or pink dots or blobs anywhere on the map. This means you have done the right thing. Now let me tell you the important and final point. A quick note here, it seems like the map's creator added that screen for a reason. The map is quite large, and the area under the orange panel is filled with grass and small bushes, which can heavily impact game performance by using up a lot of memory, CPU, and GPU resources. So, my suggestion is not to delete this permanently, just temporarily when you're filming. If you save the changes, it's not possible to revert using Control plus Z, so avoid saving, exit the game without saving, and reload it when you're done. So, if this video helped you out, please subscribe to my channel, Give the video a like, and let me know if you have any questions in the comments below. I'll be sure to get back to you.